Hey guys, it's Mike again at TV Parts Today. Uh, we're going to be removing the boards out of a Sharp television. Uh, the model number is LC-50LB481U. Uh, looks like it's going to be a pretty simple removal process. You'll see once we get into it. Uh, again, if you have any questions or comments or if you need help ordering your parts, just give us a call at 1-800-203-7484 and let's get into it. Alright guys, uh, first things first, we're going to go with this power supply. Uh, we just need to remove this clip as well as this one. Uh, if you notice, there is a latch right here. Uh, we're going to want to take this screw out first before we pull this cable out uh, to make things a lot easier, so let's get into it. And then you're just going to pinch it and pull it out. Same on this one, pinch it and pull it out. And then at this point, we've got one, two, three, four, five screws, it looks like. And we'll just take those out now. All right, and that's our power supply. All right, moving on to the T-Con. Uh, looks like we've got our regular two ribbon cables at the bottom, LVDS up at the top, and then two screws on the sides. First thing you wanna do is get this LVDS cable off of here. You're gonna pinch it on the sides and just pull it out away from you. It might be a little tough, especially if it's the first time being disconnected. This one came out relatively easy. Uh, so you just pull that out, set it to the side. For these ribbons, we just pop those up with our fingernail and you just slide that ribbon out and kind of close that. Same thing with this guy here. Just pop it up and pull it out. And then for these screws on the side, you just want to use a number one Phillips head screwdriver, not a drill. Uh, if you use a drill, uh, you run the risk of stripping these screws out, which you don't want to do. So uh, yeah, let's just take these off. And I do believe this particular T-Con is going to have some adhesive on the back of it. Uh, so just be aware of that whenever you go to pull this out of the TV. Um, it might give you some resistance. Just be gentle with it and it should lift right up out of that television. We've got those removed. Get these out of the way. Oh yeah, this one came up pretty easy. As you can see here, on the back of this T-Con, Usually you'll have this little adhesive pad. This one's sticking to the inside of the television, which that is very easily removable. You just peel that up. And last but not least, we have our main board here. Uh, looks like we just got our regular uh, cabling here. We've got one, two, three, four that we need to remove as well as this ribbon cable. Uh, we do want to remove these first because it looks like this ribbon cable goes right underneath of this cabling. Uh, so let's just get into it. On this one here, we're just going to pinch it on the top and that should pull out just, just like that. Pinch it and pull it out. Pinch and pull out. And here's the last one here, just a little guy. There we go. And as always, use your fingernail, get up underneath of that flap, and then you can gently pull that ribbon cable right out of there. There we go. Close her up. And then at this point, uh, all we have left are the screws. It looks like we've got one, two, three, four, and five. So we'll just get those removed. And it looks like this should come up, oh, very easily, very easily. Now these here, these pieces are going to fall off, that'll be just fine. Just lift this on up, and there we have our main board. So there we have it, pretty simple removal process. Uh, as always, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Um, if you do subscribe to our channel, your first order with us will be qualified for a 20% discount. Thanks, and see you next time. Thank you for watching another TV Parts Today repair video. If you have a question regarding your TV repair, post a comment and we will try to help. And don't forget, you can help us and stay up to date by subscribing, liking, and sharing our content. Also, check us out on Facebook for exclusive promo codes.